Somewhere, hidden amongst thorny brambles, is a little kingdom of elves and fairies. Everyone who lives here is very, very small. I'm Ben Elf. <coughs> and I'm Princess Holly. <laughs> Come on, let's play. Wait for us. <laughs> Ben and Holly's Little Kingdom. Today's adventure starts at Gaston's cave. Gaston the ladybird. <laughs> Gaston! Are you coming out to play? <laughs> Gaston! <laughs> Come on, let's fly! <laughs> hey, wait for us! Come on, Gaston! Giddy up, giddy up! Yee-haw! <laughs> <laughs> Can't catch me! <laughs> yes, we can! <laughs> Gaston loves fetching sticks. Gaston, fetch! <laughs> Here, Gaston! <laughs> Clever, Gaston! Well done! Gaston, do you want to wiggle your legs? OK, on to your back. <laughs> Wiggle your legs. <laughs> Gaston loves rolling on his back. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Holly, bedtime. Oh, that's Nanny Plum. I've got to go home now. Oh, but we were having such fun. Never mind. We'll meet up again tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> Ben! Bedtime! Oh, that's my mum. Bye, Ben. Bye, Gaston. Bye, Holly. Bye, Gaston. See you tomorrow. He hasn't turned up yet. Oh, let's go and find him. OK. Gaston, are you coming out to play? Gaston! Gaston's not answering. Oh. Maybe we've upset him. But we have such fun together. Yes, <laughs> like when I tip him over and he wiggles his feet. And when I ride on his back. <laughs> <laughs> but do you think Gaston enjoys it? Hmm, perhaps he doesn't. Maybe Gaston's sad. And that's why he won't come out to play. Oh, dear. What can we do? Nanny Plum will know what to do. She knows everything about ladybirds. Good idea. Dum, da, dum, dum, da, dee, da. Da, 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 dum, da, dee, da, dee. Nanny Plum, Gaston the ladybird is not happy. Hmm... Ladybirds are never happy. 
But Gaston is our best friend. Can you do something? Please, Please Manny Plum. Plum. Please. Oh, all right. I'll see what I can do. Thanks, Nanny. Cave. And what sort of insect is Gaston? He's a ladybird. Oh, yes. Now, let's think. What's ladybird for hello? <coughs> hmm. Oh, look. The door's open. We'd better take a look inside. Gaston's not here. He's gone off somewhere to be sad. <coughs> No wonder Gaston is sad. No one could be happy in such a messy, smelly cave. Chop, chop. We need to clean this cave up before the ladybird returns. Yes, that will be a nice surprise. And Gaston will be happy again. <laughs> First, we need my cleaning things. Abracadee, abracadop, brushes, dusters, soap and mop. Holly. You dust the cobwebs. Yes, Nanny Plum. Ben, you clean the floor. Yes, Nanny Plum. And I will tackle the bed. <laughs> this bed is filthy. And look at all this stuff. Old food, comics, lollipops, smelly socks. Ugh. Bish, bash, bash. Dust on bed, nice and fresh. Good. Now just a final polish and we're done. when you're sad. We're really sorry about rolling you over. And riding on your back. What's he saying, Nanny? Ooh. Gaston says he likes it when you roll him over and ride on his back. Oh. Gaston is not sad. In fact, he's very happy. <laughs> Well, you're going to be even happier now. Take a look at your cave. <laughs> Gaston! <laughs> As I said, ladybirds are never happy. Gaston, what's wrong? <laughs> oh, dear. Nanny, what did he say? He said he loved his home just as it was. All messy and smelly. Oh, sorry, Gaston. Don't worry. We'll make it just the way you like it. Yes. <laughs> We're very good at making things messy. <laughs> <laughs> this is fun. Key, a cobweb here, a cobweb there. Brilliant! Zip zap zessy, Gaston's bed, nice and messy. <laughs> Smelly socks and lollipops. <laughs> Good. Now just a final layer of dirt, and we're done. Well done, everybody. That smells just as bad as it did before. Hooray! 
And if you ever want us to make your cave untidy again, Gaston, don't be afraid to ask. Yes, that's what friends are for. <laughs> Come on, let's play. Hey, wait for us. <laughs> Come on, Gaston. Giddy up, giddy up. <laughs> 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 Yee-haw! Can't catch me. <laughs> <laughs> 